I want to talk about some things that seems like it is simple to understand. But then again, some things may be simple to understand, but they may be difficult, I guess. If I was to tell you, I want you to be happy, I want you to act like you are happy, what would you do? You may give me a smile, you know, like, you know, a big smile. <laughs> You may start thinking about thoughts that are positive, thoughts that make you happy, right? You may go and do something that you enjoy, that makes you happy, right? Okay. So what if I told you, hey, now I want you to be sad now. So what would you do? You may cry or give me a fake cry, you know, tears coming down. You may droop down your lips like, <laughs> or something like that. You, know? <laughs> you may start thinking about the bad things that happened to you. You may go around people that make you feel bad to make you feel sad, right? Let me see, what else would a person do to feel sad? You may stay to yourself more, you know, sleep all day and just have like a terrible look on your face, like, like a very like a sad face so like you would make that face or something like that <laughs> all day right okay so what if I told you hey now I want you to be angry what would you do you may have like a very mean face or if I told you to act like you are angry, what you could do is place or make your face look mean, like, or think about people that have done you wrong, you know, like, uh, you know, my parents, you know, they may have done something wrong to me and it makes me very mad, you know. Or you may get into fights, you know, things that make you angry. Okay, now you understand this, right? Okay, so in some cases, people may say that they are tired of being sad. They are tired of being mad. They are tired of being depressed. What are you doing? If you want to be happy, why are you doing things that make you depressed? If you are tired of being frustrated or angry all the time, why are you doing things that are going to make you that way? When I told you I want you to act like you are happy, you said that you may smile, you may think about positive thoughts, you may do things that you enjoy, but so those things there, that is how you get happy. So you say that you want to get happy, but you refuse to do those things. If you want to get happy, why are you not doing things that make you happy? You are tired of being mad, depressed, frustrated, so on and so on, yet you are doing things that make you stay that way. 
So if you want to get happy, what must you do? Your actions, the way you live your life must change. Because how can I say I want to be happy and I have a frown on my face all day, like, <laughs> or I stay to myself and, you know, I lay in bed, you know, and just crying <laughs> and just thinking about negative thoughts. How can I tell you that I want to be happy when I do those things? How can I say that I don't want to get cut, but I take a knife and cut myself? How can I say that I don't want any pain on, on my head, but I am taking something and banging myself right on the head constantly? <laughs> you say that you don't want to be something, but you are doing things to keep you that way. You say that you want to be something or do something, but you are doing the opposite. If you want to be happy, you have to do things that make you happy. Doing things that don't make you happy is going to make you unhappy. You see, this may sound like this seems very easy to understand, but yet many of us, including myself back in the past, I wanted to be different, but I was doing the opposite of what I wanted. Simple concept, but people don't do it. You want to change, but by your actions, by your words, or by your actions, you don't want to change. You are just seeing it. You have to say, oh, my Lord. It's about your actions. Seeing it is just one part. You have to change your actions as well. Does that make any sense? Like, I am really trying to break this thing down so people can understand this. Yes, you may, you may feel terrible right now, but if you start doing things that make you happy, yes, you still may feel bad, but sooner or later, your feelings are going to change. Because if you act like you are happy all, all the time, you are going to be that way. Think about it. You act like you are depressed all the time, right? So you are depressed all the time. So you act like you are mad all the time, right? So you are mad all the time. So how about you act like you are happy? Yes, at first, you still may be depressed or mad or whatever else. But if you continue to do it, your feelings are going to change. You can't get happy by thinking negatively. How can you? You are thinking negatively all the time, but you are trying to get happy. Makes no sense. You are trying to get out of anger, but you are constantly, consistently thinking about angry thoughts. Well, Kevin, I just can't help it. Okay. What if... <laughs> I don't know if I want to say it. You say that you can't help it. You can't help thinking the way that you do. Okay. Let me just say it. Let's say that you are not a pedophile, right? You know, a person who messes around with kids. Now, 
if a thought like that came to your mind, and if you are not that way, what is going to happen? You will quickly change your thoughts, right? So if you can change your thoughts, if those type of thoughts would come to your mind, that means that you can change your other thoughts as well. So when you don't change your thoughts, it is because you don't want to. Because if those pedophile thoughts comes to your mind, you can change it, right? Yes. So if those other thoughts come to your mind and you say that you can't change it, that is not true. You can change it, but you don't want to. Makes sense, right? If you want to feel a certain way, you have to act in that way consistently. Not just for one hour or for two hours or three hours or a week. Consistently do it. Myself, I don't really get angry that often. I don't get down that often either. But what if I constantly think about bad things that happens to me every day, all day? Hey, this happy person will be down. I am happy because I do things that make me happy. It does not mean that I don't have bad things that happens to me because <laughs> if you knew me, <laughs> so many bad things are happening to me. It is crazy. <laughs> it is really crazy. But I don't like that. I don't let that get me down because what is the point? Just because I have problems don't mean that I have to be down. Just because I have problems don't mean that I have to be mad all the time. So if you act happy constantly, you are going to be happy. If you constantly act mad, you are going to be mad. If you constantly act depressed all the time, you are going to be that way. So, the way you act, that is how you are going to feel. So if you want to feel differently, you have to act differently. Not say that you can't help it because you can help it. If there is something you really want, you will do what you have to to get it. So obviously, you don't want to be happy if you are not happy. Well, Kevin, you know, back in my past, you know, my mom did this to me. My dad did this. My uncle, my sister, my cousin, my aunt, my friend, this person here. So... Everyone have had someone do something wrong to them. So shall we all be down? Shall we? I think not. So I pray that this makes sense. God bless.